what a go on everybody welcome back let's make this balanced bowl i've been enjoying this for the past week now and i had to share the recipe it's super filling hearty and delicious so here i have two carrot and king oyster mushroom that i'm going to roast if you don't have king oyster mushroom you can use another mushroom okay so you just want to roughly chop them Here I have some cooked chickpeas that I'm also going to roast. So just combine everything, add your seasonings and roast at 400 degrees Fahrenheit for about 25 minutes. Once you've added all the seasonings, combine properly and place on a baking tray and, and as I said, bake at 400 degrees Fahrenheit for 25 minutes. Here I have a few cloves of garlic that I'm going to roast for the salad dressing. I'm going to drizzle a little bit of oil and roast at the same temperature, same time. While those roast, let's cook some rice and quinoa. Here I have 3 4 cups of quinoa and 1 cup of rice. Make sure to rinse it off first. Once you're done rinsing the quinoa and rice, add it to your pot followed by water, coconut oil and salt. We're going to allow this to steam over a medium heat. While the rice and quinoa cook, I'm going to cut up lettuce, tomato and scallion. You can use whatever leafy green of your choice. Once you're done, set that to the side. Let's mash an avocado or where I'm from, we call this pear. To this, I'm going to add lemon juice, scallion, salt and pepper. So once you're done, just set this to the side. So as you can tell here, the chickpea, mushroom and carrot roast as well as the garlic. Let's move on to the salad dressing. Here I'm adding some raw cashews, basil, the roasted garlic. I'm also going to add salt, pepper, lemon juice and blend until smooth. And as usual, all the ingredients will be listed in the description. So make sure to check that out. So once you're done blending, you should get a consistency like this, all right? So now that everything is prepared, let's put this balanced bowl together. Of course, you could stop here and enjoy this as is, but I'm going to go a step further and add some pumpkin seed, the salad dressing and some nutritional yeast. that's it my people thank you so much for watching i hope you try and enjoy this recipe and until next time big up on yourself